Your sword is a little bit on the heavier side, but because of the pommel you have over here, it actually balances it out. There are areas that are sharp, and there are areas that are not as sharp. On the final blow, that edge has proven to be very sharp and actually would disembowel this ballistic dummy. Your sword, sir, will kill. All right, David, it's your turn. You ready? Let's do it. Let's do this. Brian's blade hit cut. It's slashed, it's stabbed. We got some competition here today. Just can't wait to see how mine goes. <laughs> that is one of the sharpest swords I've ever come across. It's wicked scary. The cuts are lacerating almost in half. Without a doubt, your weapon will kill. Awesome. Ben? Gentlemen, to test the strength and durability of your edges, I'm going to attack these fully armored knights. But this test is all about what the armor does to your sword, not what your sword does to the armor. Brian, you're up first. Are you ready? Absolutely. Brian, your edge held up really well. It's a very obtuse grind that lends itself to this kind of test. The handle was comfortable. It's a nice shape. I was able to index very well. It stayed straight in the tests and didn't pick up any damage. Well done. Thank you. David, you're up next. Well, Dave, you have a much finer edge on this sword, and it's picked up a little bit of rolling. There's some edge deflection right here. You can hear it. But all in all, very good sword. Thank you, sir. So next up is the sharpness test, and for that, I'll give you to Dave. All right, gentlemen, next up, the swinging sandbag slice. I will cut this rope with one edge of your blade, releasing that sandbag, and then cutting that with the other edge of your blade. Let's see if they still have an edge. Brian, you're up. Are you ready? I am more than a little bit nervous because Dave's weapon is clearly a slicer and parts of my blade were not as sharp as others. My blade will only cut if they can get it into that sweet spot that I built into the blade. Otherwise, I'm dead. First off, there are sections of this blade that just don't have much of an edge. That first cut and just skated up the rope. Second cut bit in, went right through. You can see how there's a lot of tearing at the edge of that bag, as opposed to a clean slice through it. I would have loved to have seen a little bit more edge, especially on that front half. David, you ready? Absolutely. OK. Your sword's sharp, very sharp. Pass through the rope, no problem. Pass through the bag, no problem. As far as the design of your sword, would have loved to have seen a counterbalance on this. Uh, this would be nice on a dagger. It's very small for this sword. Without that counterbalance, all that weight is so far forward. But it's a cutter. It's definitely sharp. Nicely done. Thank you. 